Hi guys, welcome back to another video of Fijua channel. So in this video, we will be discussing about a drug. So this will be belonging to the pharmacology section or veterinary medicine section. So this is a very important drug used in the veterinary field to treat many of the conditions. So the drug is Vincristin. So we might have heard about this drug during our chemotherapy sessions in the pharmacology. So this drug belongs to anti-cancer drug or anti-tumor drug. So please subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon for more updates. So moving to the introductory part which is the most important that is Vincristin is an anti-tumor drug which is isolated from Vinca rosia and they belong to a chemical class known as alkaloid. So they belong to the class Vinca alkaloid. So if you want to learn more about the pharmacology of alkaloids you can see my video on the chemotherapy that is anti-tumor drugs so i'll giving the link in the description box so this is actually the plant vinca rosia so the vincristin is extracted from the plant so this is actually the structure which is a very complicated chemical structure so the mechanism of action is actually the vincristin works by binding to the tubulin protein stopping the tubulin dimers from polymerizing to form the microtubules. So what happens? The microtubules will not be formed. So what happens? The cells get arrested in the replication phase. So this will act on those cells which are replicating in an unwanted manner, that is the cancer cells. So they have got affinity towards the cancer cell and they will be binding to the cancer cells microtubules or the tubulin protein and the prevent the polymerization of the dimers to form the microtubules. So what happens? The cell phase get arrested. Cell cycle phase get arrested. So the cell will be unable to separate its chromosomes during the metaphase. So what happens? The metaphase arrest will be there. So what happens? The cell then undergoes apoptosis. That is the programmed cell death. Cell death which is programmed by the cell itself. So the cancer cells will die. That is actually the aim of Vincristin therapy. So this is actually the vincristin. They will bind to the tubulin protein and they will freeze the microtubules polymerization in the microtubules get deorganized and the chromosome will not be fusing apart and this will lead to the apoptosis of that cell. So this is the mitotic arrest. They will be arresting at the metaphase and mitotic death will be there. So indications. Where all can we use this vincristin? That is acute lymphoblastic leukemia. That is cancer of WBC cells. Hodgkin's disease, non-Hodgkin's lymphoma, small sarcomas, rhabdomyosarcoma, neuroblastoma, Wilms tube. So the dosage and administration for TVP and all that is transmissible venereal tumor. So in case of veterinary field, we will be mainly using this drug for TVD. That is 0.025 mg per kg body weight. So we have, should have to give very strict IV routine. Fine. Because if at all we are giving any other way, this can lead to tissue necrosis and this can lead to very serious illness of the animal and this can even lead to myocarditis and death. So the side effects are mainly blood in urine and stools, injection at the site of pain and there will be warm. So blood or double vision, constipation, joint pain, stomach cramps, unusual bleeding or bruising, dizziness and loss of appetite, loss of appetite because it has got gastrointestinal problems. So main drug interactions are dexamethasone that is the steroids, atana, atazanavir that is actually the viral drug and phenobarbital those are the hypnotic sedative drugs, erythromycin, itraconazole and atorvastatin. So atorvastatin is actually a BP controlling drug and itraconazole is a fungal drug. So whenever we are undergoing a dexamethasone therapy or itraconazole therapy, we should be very careful while administering this vincristine. So other side effects is mainly myeloid suppression that is what happens the cells which should provide the immunity those are the lymphocytes they will die or they will not be able to perform their natural function. So we should have to deal with the immunity of the animal and gastrointestinal problems will be there mainly vomiting will be there and peripheral neuropathy so there will be mainly ataxia convulsions may be there and peripheral neuropathy will be there. So we should have to give liver supplements and hemopoietic tonics along with immunoboosters. So the veterinary use mainly in case of transmissible venereal tumor and other benign tumors. So the presentation is mainly 1 mg per ml. That is 1 mg milligram of vincristin will be there in 1 ml. So these are actually the brands. So this is from Sipa that is 
cytocrystin that is vincristin sulfate united states pharmacopoeia what is 1 mg per ml and this is the same drug and this is next that is from actiza that is this can be also go for im infusion because this drug has got some special purpose so they are prepared for im use also and vincristin sulfate injection 1 mg per ml will be there this is actually the most important drug that is from neon pharmaceuticals that is vincristin sulfate injection that is 1 mg per ml percentage so this is only uh, 1 mg per ml vinlon this is another brand from ceylon labs so warning uh, never play with actually vincristin okay vincristin is a very serious dangerous drug it can lead to serious illness and can even lead to myocardial infarction and death so be careful never play with vincristin thank you